So you're thinking of moving to downtown Vancouver, but you're not quite sure which area or neighborhood might be right for you. Well, in this video, I'm gonna break down the top three neighborhoods in downtown Vancouver, as well as one other neighborhood that might surprise you. And we're getting after it right after this. Hey everyone, I'm Craig Veroni with 3MAX Masters Realty. I'm a local real estate agent here in Vancouver, BC. I was actually named one of the top 50 video influencers in real estate in North America for the past two consecutive years for the way I utilize video to sell my clients homes and educate them as well. Today's video is all about the top three neighborhoods in downtown Vancouver that's gonna fit your lifestyle. So if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button on this video, and don't forget to hit that bell as well so you can be notified the moment I have a new video out. All right, let's get into it. Downtown Vancouver is divided into four sub areas. You've got downtown, Yale Town, the West End, and Coal Harbor. We're kicking things off right now with the downtown sub area. I just love the vibrancy and energy of this city. And each of the four sub areas that we're about to explore is going to offer something different for you. The downtown core offers you unprecedented access to the most amazing restaurants and shopping that Vancouver has to offer. And Robson and Burrard is really the epicenter of where things begin here in Vancouver. We're at the corner here of Robson and Burrard where we've got the famous Sutton Place Hotel where all the stars come and stay when they're filming here in Vancouver. And this is really the start of the shopping district for Vancouver. You've got the Pacific Center Mall just east of us here, and then all of the shopping that happens down Robson Street, which we're gonna go check out in just a minute. So here we are at the corner of Robson and Burrard. And as I said, this really is the start of the shopping district for uh, downtown Vancouver. I've got Victoria's Secret right beside me, Lululemon across the street, and if you start heading this way down Robson Street towards Denman, you're gonna find all of your favorite stores. A Bernie Street between Burrard and Thurlow is really Vancouver's Rodeo Drive. This is where you're going to find all of your favorite high-end exclusive shops like Tiffany's, Hermes, Jimmy Choo, Prada, Tory Burch, all your favorites right here in this one or two block area. The downtown sub area is selling at a 32% sales ratio as of last month, meaning one in every three homes are selling right now, which is a strong seller's market. Now, Yale Town is the hip, vibrant, and energetic part of this city. You're gonna find lots of bars and nightclubs here, as well as fantastic restaurants and shopping. And yet, just a couple of blocks away, right in this neighborhood, you've got Elsie Roy Elementary School right here, the Roundhouse Community Center right there, the waterfront just a half a block away, urban fair, all kinds of grocery shopping and, and coffee shops, everything that you need amenity-wise right here but you're in a much quieter neighborhood and you're just a few blocks away from all the hustle and bustle in the action of Yale Town. So if you have a family, if you're a young family with kids, this is a terrific lifestyle for you. Yale Town is currently selling at a 30% sales ratio, putting it in a strong seller's market. The West End has always been a special place for me because I used to live here for almost 20 years of my life and west of Denman is particularly special, mostly because you're just blocks away from the beach here at English Bay and Stanley Park. You know, we, we lived here for the first two years of my son William's life and we used to call this our backyard. So the beach in Stanley Park was our backyard. And I have so many amazing memories of that time with him him running bare-chested through the trails in Stanley Park or digging in the dirt and playing in the ocean at Third Beach or Second Beach or even here at English Bay. It really was an amazing time being downtown here with him when he was so young. And it's no wonder that many other families are opting to do the same and raise their young families downtown, getting a, a condo or townhouse, trading in that little bit of square footage that you might get in a, in a detached home. but opting for the convenience and access to all the amazing amenities that you have right here downtown. The West End is selling at a 25% sales ratio as of last month, meaning one in every four homes are selling, which is a good seller's market.
Coal Harbour is the fourth sub-area in downtown Vancouver. It offers you fabulous views of the water and the North Shore Mountains. I mean, imagine waking up to this every morning. Here comes one of those seaplanes. You could sit, have a coffee and watch seaplanes go all day long. It is also a wonderful place to raise a young family. You've got the Coal Harbour Community Centre right here. You've got Stanley Park just west of us. And everything is incredibly walkable, accessible right at your doorstep. So whether you're a young couple or have a young family, you may seriously want to consider Coal Harbour because it may surprise you that this sub area is sitting at a 7% sales ratio right now. That's a serious buyer's market, folks. So while the other three sub areas in Vancouver are all strong seller's markets right now, this is the only one that's in a buyer's market. So you may want to seriously give Coal Harbor another look. As I mentioned, I'm Craig Veroni with Remax Masters Realty. I'm your local real estate agent here in the Metro Vancouver area. So if you have any questions at all, if you're moving here, relocating here, be sure to reach out and give me a call. You can send me a text, shoot me an email, or call me on my mobile number. I shoot a ton of videos about what it's like to live, love, and own here in Vancouver. So if you haven't yet, be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button on this video, and don't forget to hit the bell as well so you can be notified the moment I have a new video out. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button, give this video a like, and leave a comment in the comment section below. You know, like I said, I've shot a ton of videos about the various neighborhoods in Vancouver and we'll be featuring many more in the upcoming weeks. But if there's a specific area or neighborhood that you'd like me to feature or film, make sure you leave that in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day. And remember, this is where you live, love, own Vancouver.